Happy Friday, Team LCPS. This is your proud superintendent, Doug Straley, joining you on this beautiful day with Louis A. Lyon to bring you the latest edition of our Team LCPS MVP Awards episode. Like I said, it's a beautiful day and even a better day because it's Kindness Day here at Louisa County Public Schools. And even Louis A. Lyon is getting in on the action. Check out these awesome photos. Everywhere we went today, our students and staff members were decked out in their kindness shirts and showing one another that kindness matters here in Louisa County. The shirts say it all, kind is cool, and there's no doubt about it, kind is cool here in LCPS. And it's almost hard to believe, but we've hit October. And as you know, each October, we launch month-long initiatives that are focused on spreading kindness. This year, we've got a lot of great projects coming up, and we're going to be cleaning up our community, spreading thank you cards around the county, visiting with our local first responders, supporting organizations that train therapy dogs, hosting coin drives, and a whole lot more. So be on the lookout, because very soon, we're going to be releasing a video with all of these details. At LCPS, we believe in building up not just great students, but great people, and part of that is putting kindness into action. That's what this team does. And this upcoming month, we're kicking it into high gear. So again, be on the lookout for a video coming out very soon with complete details on how we'll be spreading kindness throughout our community through the month of October. Also, I want to remind you two important dates coming up here at LCPS. First, next Friday, a week from today, October 8th, we're hosting our last regular season home football game of the school year. It's not just the last regular season home game. It'll be music night here in the jungle where our students from throughout the county come together to show off their amazing talents. And it's our annual rivalry matchup against the Orange County Hornets. So next Friday night, not tonight, but next Friday night in the jungle, music night, all of our students through the county coming together to host a wonderful evening. And finally, before we get to our MVPs, October 11th will be our teacher work day here at LCPS. That's Monday, October 11th will be a teacher work day here at LCPS. All right, let's get this party started. Let's spread some kindness today by recognizing some awesome people here on our team, our Team LCPS MVPs. And first up, our Community MVP of the Week. And this week, the honor goes to Corporal Daniel Clore. Corporal Clore is our school resource officer at LCMS. And in his first year with our Bobcats, he is making great impressions in the nominations we received. For Corporal Clore, he was described as compassionate, helpful, and professional. Like all of our SROs, Corporal Clore is doing a great job building positive relationships with our students and staff. Corporal Clore, you're a newest member of our team here at LCPS, but you're leading the way, and we're so glad to have you on campus working with our Bobcats and making our community a better place. That's what an MVP does, and today, that's what you are. You're our community MVP. Well done, great job, and thank you for all of your hard work. Next up, it's time to name our classified MVP of the week, and for that, we head to Jewett Elementary School to honor Miss Amanda Roberts. Miss Roberts works in the cafeteria department for JES, and along with the entire cafeteria team, she takes so much pride in taking care of our trailblazers. In one nomination we received, it said Ms. Roberts always has a positive attitude. We've been called superheroes here in the cafeteria, and that's what Ms. Roberts is, a true superhero. And here's some numbers for you. So far this year, Ms. Roberts and the JES cafeteria team have served more than 30,000 meals. That's right, 30,000, an incredible effort, and it's well-deserving of recognition. So to Ms. Roberts, we say congratulations to you on a job well done. You're this week's classified MVP, and to our entire team at Jewett, you all share in this success. We're so thankful for all of you, and we're proud to call you members of Team LCPS. Fantastic job, keep up the awesome work. All right, on to our certified MVP of the week. And this week, we head to Moss Knuckles Elementary School to honor Mr. Miguel Staples. Support is one of our non-negotiables here at LCPS, and that's the word that comes to mind when you think of Mr. Staples. He is supportive of his students and works with them throughout the day to help them reach their full potential. One nomination we received said Mr. Staples is a dedicated and caring teacher, and he has done a fantastic job working with students and is well organized with his instructional time. Mr. Staples, we are proud of you and the 212 effort that you're giving for your Foxes this school year. Your support, your kindness is certainly making a difference. Great job and congratulations because you're this week's certified MVP. Well done and great job. 
And finally, we name our student MVP of the week. And this week, we honor two awesome lions, Emmy and Byers and Alexis Downey. These two young ladies are amazing representatives of what it means to have lion pride. Emmy and played a huge role in organizing this year's homecoming parade and did a great job serving as a leader for the leadership team. And Alexis did an incredible job organizing this year's homecoming dance at Walton Park this past week. These two young ladies made phone calls, talked with sponsors and vendors, and got the job done. Ladies, we're so proud of both of you. You're incredible leaders who care about providing events where our students and community members can make memories that will last a lifetime. Great job to both of you, and I know these MVP awards are well deserved. All right. Those are our Team LCPS MVPs of the week. Join me in congratulating this week's awesome group. Our community MVP, Corporal Daniel Clore. Our classified MVP, Ms. Amanda Roberts in the Jewett Elementary School Cafeteria. Our certified MVP, Mr. Miguel Staples at Moss Knuckles Elementary School. And our student MVPs, Ms. Emmy and Byers and Ms. Alexis Downey at LCHS. Another awesome group of MVPs. So please be sure to take a moment to comment below and congratulate each of them for a job well done. Team LCPS, it's been another incredible week here at LCPS, and it's hard to believe that we're one week away from the end of the first quarter of this school year. Throughout this school year, learning has been brought to life day after day, and I'm so proud of this team and this community for rallying together to set the standard for excellence in education. So keep it up, Team LCPS. Keep working together, and as always, keep submitting those MVP nominations as well. And finally, don't forget, our final regular season home football game is one week from today, and we'll have music night here in the jungle, bringing students from every school to show off their talents. Have a great weekend, Team LCPS. Stay healthy, stay safe, and remember, we are Team LCPS.